Hello and welcome to my stocking stuffers for a preteen girl and an upper elementary aged boy video. First of all, I start with some food items. I chose these mini dark chocolate sea salt caramels from the Wonder Shop at Target and they will fit perfectly in the toe of the stocking. And then next I found these hot chocolate bombs from Palmer, which I know is an Easter candy company, but they're making hot chocolate bombs. I checked the ingredients to make sure that there was no food coloring because we try not to do food coloring in our family. I found these at the Dollar Tree, so th that will be great also here at the bottom. And then I try to balance it out with one of these Clementines or Cuties. This is something that we put in our stockings every year, just as a throwback or homage to both my roots and my husband's roots because all of our grandparents got oranges in their stockings when they were growing up. Next, I have these Pilot Friction Fine Liner Markers. They are erasable. I love the Pilot brand and I love the friction. So there's actually one in here. You can see this white tip is the eraser part. They have multi-barrel pens where you can put different colors in it, but this one's obviously blue. But they have come out with not only highlighters, but markers. So we already have the erasable highlighters and I thought these would just be so much fun. So. They're, they're fine at a 0.7, so each of them will get that in their stocking. And then we are a Lego family, so both my kids like Legos. My youngest, who is the upper elementary aged boy, really likes Legos, but my, my preteen daughter does as well. So what I do is over the year, I listen to what they say that they want. And my daughter wanted this little girl that goes with a friend's Lego series. And she's not a grown up. She's actually a young girl and she really wanted this one. And so I was able to find this one separately without a big, huge kit. My son also wanted a Santa Claus and so I found them. And so I just collect them over the year when I see them for a good price and keep them ready to, to put in the stockings. My kids also really like the little animals. So I was able to find them a raccoon and a chihuahua. These are little frogs and mushrooms, a husky. So these are just, again, as the year progresses and they say, oh, we're missing this animal. Or did you know Lego now makes this as a separate little animal? I grab them and I usually get them on eBay. And then I really try to listen to what their interests are and tailor their stocking to that. So this is where things kind of get separated, but this is a poison ring. You can see it opens up like that. And my daughter has a bit of an interest in jewelry. It's not a lot, but she does like to wear rings now and again, especially when we go out. And so I thought this would be a nice gift for her. And again, these are things that I collect over the year. And then as I mentioned, my son really likes Legos. And so there are certain things that he has mentioned that he really wants. So for instance, we have some Hogwarts kits and apparently Hermione does not have a bed. And so I found this on eBay. It's just a little bed set or kit where if he doesn't have these kind of odd, unusual pieces or he's using them for something else, this will build a bed and a side table. So that will fit in there. Also taking into account my kids' interests on Amazon, I found this bird call. My daughter really loves birds. She's very into them. And so I thought this would be a fun gift to throw in the stocking as it's small. And then to balance that out, I found these light up bricks that light up different colors. You can change the batteries on. And I thought that they would be a nice addition. They're not legitimate Lego, but they will work with Lego kits. And then lastly, Every year we donate to WWF and get a kind of like adoption stuffed animal. This is just one example and I will just kind of tuck him in to the top of the stocking and have him peeking out of the top, which just makes it a fun little added flavor to seeing their stockings on Christmas morning.
Thanks so much for watching. Until next time.